Good afternoon, everyone. Welcome to the How to Craft Network studio. My name is, as if you don't already know, my name is Tony Darrick. Thank you so much for coming and saying hi. I can see all of you chatting. You're all giddy kippers. I'm feeling quite jazzed. It's a new word we all need to get down with, feeling jazzed. If you don't know what I mean, it's a USA um, way of saying feeling motivated and a bit giddy, giddy kipper, you know? So we're all feeling jazzed this afternoon. Great show today, guys. I've put some incredible prices together for you. Hopefully there's something in the show. You need to top up on your glue. You fancy a stamp cleaning cloth. I've got it all going on today. Yes, I have had my sandwich and I am raring to go. My coffee's over there, ready for me too. If you are not a subscriber, make sure you click that subscribe button. Maybe you are brand new to the channel. I am not always this giddy. I've had a wonderful few days, should I say, since Friday. I've been doing sneak peeks for our brand new HSN launch over on America. Ooh, giddy, excited, nervous, all in one, jazzed, feeling it all. Um, but I'm feeling absolutely great. Um, so much to tell you about. I've got something to tell you about over there too. But let's talk about today's show. If you click that little um, bell as well, that will give you that fabulous half an hour notice as well when we are going to go live. So you're never going to miss a show. Once the deals have gone, they've gone. But we don't take them off. They just stay on until they sell through. So please don't worry if you are at work. You know, you might be able to catch the show later. If you are able right now to click that share button for this show, please do so. I don't know if you've noticed, and I do apologise, if over the weekend you've all been getting like friend requests or join groups or um, come and say hi or... So I was just sat on my um, technology at home with my son and I saw this invite button. I'm like, oh, clicked invite. And a load of people came up and I thought, why are these people not in my group? All crafters, all got friends, mutual friends. So I just went down the whole list, invite, 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 invite. Well, <laughs> all the messages I got back saying, have I been hacked? <laughs> So funny. The finger, giddy kipper finger, jazzed finger. My gosh. So if you did get something from me, it probably was genuine. It was me. I'm absolutely pants with technology, if I'm completely honest. But I felt like all the people that were on there were probably missing out if they were not part of our fabulous group or a friend or a, in this group. I didn't actually know where it was going to take you all, but it was me. And if I frustrated you in any way, I'm so sorry. But it has made me smile, if nothing else. So let's talk about the Shay show. Shay show today, ladies and gents. I have a lovely show for you. And when Tim was getting ready for the show today, he said to me, it's a lovely show this today. Well done, sweetheart. I'm like, I know, it's always a lovely show. I love to put great shows together for our lovely crafters at home. So let's have a look at the first item on the counter. Now, it does say the show is called Let's Talk Tools, and that is exactly it. And I've put this in bundle together for you because some of the components have been to create and craft. Some of them have been here in studio, and some of them have been in, available as individuals. And I'm often asked, will they be going to create and craft with savings? Will they be in studio with savings? Can I use my HTCM points? So what I've done is I've put the full bundle together to cut out any of the buy this from there, buy this bit from there, buy that that bit from there and eventually hopefully you'll end up with it all i've put the whole bundle together today for you so in this collection you have the large six inch cutting machine the big one which retails at 44.99 i'm not even going to go straight into the price but this retails at 44.99 on its own then we have our next tool which is your three inch cutting machine and this one retails at 30 pounds then we have your three cutters. So you have your super large, which is brilliant for your 12 by 12s and beyond. Then we have the next one down, which is 12 by 12 and below. They've all got that extending arm. And then we have your mini for your craft bag, should you wish. And on there, you've got the cutting blade, which is the pink element on the two larger ones and the white one, which is your embossed one. So if you want to do score lines and cards and things like that. And then also at the base here, I have popped in an extra set of blades. So you're never going to um, be short with your blades and things like that so large cutting machine small cutting machine three trimmers and replacement blades normally 142.44 today 79.99 so if you are starting out it might be a great starting point i don't have hundreds of them but if you are brand new to craft and have one guillotine that's not working quite right and don't have a die cutting machine then they have the complete bundle here now you all know if you are part of the club you get that extra five percent off that 79.99 and if you have accrued those points it's going to be less than 70 pounds so maybe giftables something like that 
but that's the reason why I've put that one together for you today. So I'm going to quickly move on from that. That was selling before we came to wear and I don't have lots. So let's move on to the next one. Gossip sparkle pens, ink worth talking about, okay? Four sets of sparkle pens. Now you get three pens in each collection and I will tell you what colours they are. Um, but basically they are a sparkly ink, dye-based ink that you can dilute down watercolour with. We've been doing these for years now and these are some of our most popular colours. So you get four sets here, three pens in each box. Normally, $14.99 a box. Four and 19.99 18.99 if you are in that club absolutely incredible savings today for you so let's have a look at some of the colors in here and i'm just going to pick them up and read the colors now when i say the colors on here let me just see if i can open this box i don't want to tear it because it is sealed let's see if it'll let me in when you get them out let me just show you So you get your three pens in each box. I'll just move this to the side, Tim, so you can see there, sorry. So we have like the teal, the purple, and the sort of green color there, okay? So let me just, sorry, onto here. There we go, is that better? So you'll see they've got this little cap on there, that's your safety cap. I have done videos on how to get the lids off these and I have done videos on how to activate these as well. So we have a steel green, a purple and a lake blue. Now, these are just representative colours that are on here. When the ink comes out of these barrels, they are at least two shades darker. They do not represent really the colour that's on there. So if you're thinking, I love those colours, try and imagine them a little bit darker. And I do encourage that when you get them home, do a swatch for them all because the ink is it's pretty much the same, but it is darker. So when you, if you may be expecting this like subtle purple, it will be darker. So you're going to have to dilute it down. Okay. We didn't get the colours to represent the plastic on there very well. It's incredibly difficult to do. So do a swatch with them, but you're definitely going to get the blue, the purple and the green. They're just a touch darker than what they actually are on that panel there. So you get your four sets in there. So this one is your lake blue, purple and steel green. And I'll just read off the other colours for you. And then we have olive, a lilac and a tangerine. Then we have a yellow, a burgundy and a dark red, which is more like a mahogany red. And then we have a navy green and an orange yellow. So you've got an eclectic mix of colours there. But like I said, normally $14.99, you're getting all four boxes today. If you are in the club, $18.99. If you're accruing those points, you're going to get them for £15, £16 pounds for all. So for extra pounds, you're getting all four rather than just the one. Item number 100316. They're already flying. This was selling before um, we came to air. The next item was already selling. I know you like watercolour. You love to colour, don't you, you guys? Makes me very happy knowing that you're all having fun. So let's move on then to this item number. This one is 100317. Now we brought this to you in a different format about three or four months ago. And if you remember, it opened in a different format. Well, this is exactly the same, but it has metallic in this one and it has your sparkly ones. So it comes with the extendable arms with the metallic sparkle, your tra traditional pigment ink, the brush slots into the base. In fact, I'll just show you here. Let me just open it out. And then you have the palette. Now, if you, they're a great pigment, um, ink although they do look very young and juvenile in the case but the inks in there are very very pigmented so yes they are very fitting for young ones because of the case however the inks are amazing and if you are maybe craft grouping it on the go maybe thinking about a present for somebody you have an amazing set of watercolors here now 27.99 you will get those discounts if you are in the club as well. And you also get the water brush in the base there. So club members 26, 59, 100317. And it comes in a beautiful sort of sturdy box, which has got a magnetic closure. So it is a fabulous giftable if you are thinking about a grandchild or a sister or a mother who's maybe getting into their craft. So lovely, lovely starting point there. The inks are truly amazing. Truly, truly amazing. So they're from the Superior brand and we have lots of products from Superior. And it has the finger hole on the back as well. So if you are painting on the go, you can have it in your hand and paint from your hand as well. Nothing's been missed out there. I have the other one. 
which me and Tom used together actually. Um, and a lot of you bought that one, but this is exactly the same really. The colours are slightly different. You get the metallics in there as well. And the front comes down rather than out like the last one. So if you missed out last time, maybe this is an opportunity. 100317 today, 2659. So moving down the counter, Maybe you've run out of glue. Would you like to top up on your glue? Today I've put this uh, bundle together for you. So this is your five sets of Perfect Together. It's dual tipped, brilliant for your mat and layers, brilliant for sticking your flowers on. It dries clear. Um, 100318 today, 12.99 for all five, normally 19.95. So maybe you need to top up on some glue. Maybe you've never tried the glue before, but basically it is a dual tip. So you have the sponge dauber area. So if you want to do those mat and layers, you can instead of lots of glue splurging out everywhere. But equally, if you like your precision tip as well, then you have the precision tip as well. There we go. Emma adores this. And I think it's because it's pink, though. <laughs> she loves pink. You know what she's like. 100318. Today, 1234 in the club. So moving down, we have our fabulous cleaning cloths. And these are cloths that do not gather bacteria. They go back in the tube. You wet them with some water to hydrate them. The cloth then dries dry, so all of the bacteria and ugliness disappears. Then when you're ready to clean your stamps again, you just activate it under the water, clean your stamp off, roll it back up, pop it back in its tube, and it is literally good to go. It has a textured side on one side, a smooth side on the other. So if you want to use it as a traditional cloth for your glass mat, you can do that as well. But on the other side, it has a textured element, so it can get into all those sort of nooks and crannies on your stamps and clean that residue away. Super, super affordable. There's two in this collection today 100319 two stamp cleaning cloths 100319949 today and then lastly I'm going to use both of these in my demo two of my all-time favorite stamps one of a recent one and one from old old absolutely amazing so we have this beautiful a5 background i'm going to show you a cool technique using this one it's a huge tropical sort of design background a5 in design amazing for your watercolors if you've got the watercolors in show even the sparkle pens would look incredible on this so this one is 100320 today seven was 17.99 today in the club nine pound fifty great savings never been more a reason to tune in we always have an incredible show sometimes we have awesome deals sometimes we do um buy three save 10% free postage, double points, things like that. But it's just going to be that one-stop shop where you can come, get some inspiration as always, whether it be with me or some of our other fabulous guests. And you're going to be able to just come and get some hints and tips and techniques. It's just a lovely place to come. I love and adore my studio. And guess what? Nobody can take it away from me ever. The last item on the counter, another stamp. This has only been launched, what, a month? 100321. There isn't a lot of this. This is what is left. Okay. £10 today, £9.50 in the club. 100321. A5. Stamps are absolutely beautiful. Find your own happiness. Let's do it. Let's do it. So that is the full counter today, ladies and gents. I hope you found something that you absolutely like. But equally, if you haven't, it's not the end of the world. Stay tuned. I've got two great demos. And hopefully you'll have something in your stash that you can make work with the demos that I'm going to do today. I appreciate we've all got all the stash in the world. So if anything, come for the inspiration as well. And come and say hi to the lovely ladies and gents because there are ladies that tune in every single day. And we do actually worry when they're not there because they're there every single day. So I'm going to go over to the other side of the counter. We're going to show you the full counter of products available today. Have a good look at them. Have a peruse in your own time, your own leisure. They are there until they sell out, so don't panic. Only thing I would say is that tool, bundle and sparkle pen are the only two at the moment that are going to cause me problems probably later. Look at that gorgeous counter. How cool is that? As you can see there, ladies and gents, the big tool is missing. It is on the counter though, you do get the six inch cutting tool as well. Shall we say hello to some friends? Have you shared? I'm gonna do a giveaway, you need to share. So if you are on Facebook, click that share button. 
Don't be getting in trouble or thinking people have been hacked like me. Gosh, I tell you, keep me away from technology. So share the video and then after the video, if you want to pop a comment underneath, I'm going to give a few bits and pieces that I've used live in studio today because I just like to give stuff away. And you know what? My sample room stroke prep room is bursting at the seams. So it's just a good way to, um, you know, send out hopefully some product that people are going to love and use rather than me trying to. Do you know what it's like? I open the door and I'm like this. Get in, get in. And then I shut the door really quick. And then a box come from Create and Craft with samples in, right? Like Emma's came back from TV. I was like, oh, where am I going to pull that? And I opened the door and it all fell out. And just sort of like put it on top. And like, I had to put a sign on saying, do not enter. <laughs> Your life will be at risk if you open that door. Oh, so funny. So let's say hello to some of our friends. Oh, there's lots of you on social media too. So hi, Sue. Hi, Marie. Hi, Phyllis. Hi, Sandra. Hi, Roxy Lee. Hi, Selma. Gillian. Jan. Justine. Oh, Justine. Have you been around, sweetheart? I think I've missed that name for a little while. I hope you're okay, sweetheart. Or maybe I've just missed your name. But uh, Justine, I hope you're well. Elizabeth, Enid, Irene, Julie, Shirley, Kathleen, Michaela, Charlotte, Latricia. Latricia? Should you not be in bed? Is it a bit early? What time is it, Latricia, in the USA? Please tell me. Roxanne, Michaela, David Johnson, Tracy Brahimi, Amanda Stratton, Gillian Howard. What, Roxy Lee, Shirley Ramsey, you're all getting your surnames now, today's surnames. <laughs> Phyllis Gullick, Valerie Lilly, Stamps by Me USA, oh, that's me. <laughs> joking, joking. Come on, let's have some fun. Have we got a cup of tea or a cup of coffee, guys? No gin. Let's have some fun. So... Let's bring in, oh, Tim, is it possible? Sorry, could you just pass me that big die cutting machine that I just put there to sample? Thank you. So I'm using my big die cutting machine. Now, if you are getting that bundle, you will get this large cutting machine in your set. You'll also get the mini and all of those cutting tools too. But first of all, I want to do a bit of a technique here. So I'm sort of doing a slimline card today because I'm going to chop it up a little bit. Tony, you're making me famous now. Tracy, you've always been famous. You're everywhere for your lovely cards. <laughs> Hi, Tony. Bernadette Gallia. Oh, that's a nice name. Bernadette Gallia. Very nice name. It's 9am Eastern time, Latricia says. Good morning. Have you had your cup of tea? <laughs> Trinkles Garden and Home Life. Good morning from I Irene in Georgia. My gosh. Good morning, Trinkles Garden and Home Life. What's your real name? I'd like to talk to your real name. I can't say that every time I want to talk to you. Right, let's have some fun. So I need everybody to start saying, instead of get a kipper, we're saying we're getting jazzed. Okay, we need to get down with... i just clean my door here because it's, it's a little bit scruffy. Carol's finally been able to get rid of the gas man so she can watch the show. <laughs> Jazzy hands, Gillian Howard said. Jazzy hands. <laughs> right, I'm going to use for my first demo this one. This super large floral background. It's a stunner. And I mean, it must be three years since we did this one. We ordered it two or three times. And it's one that probably most of you still put your hands on now. So I'm going to dig mine out here. So let's have some fun. So I'm going to, let me just explain what I've got going on here. So I've got a piece of white card and a piece of pink and they're both exactly the same. Okay, exactly the same size. I'm not sure if that pink's showing up great, but one is pink, one is white. So let's just move this over a little bit. Let's just create a bit of space. Teresa's jazzed, Shirley's jazzed. Latricia's feeling jazzed, jazzed. Latricia, is that the word that is that a word that you would use at home? Feeling jazzed, like we say, oh, I'm feeling like a giddy kipper today. Would you say jazzed? What other words would you use, Latricia, at home? We need to get in, you know, all these good words. So first of all, 
I'm just going to pop this pink into the corner of my Eureka, okay? Now I'm popping it into the corner because it's a big stamp and if my magnet's going to be in way, but I know if at least I pop it back in the corner, it's going to be okay. Oh, David's got this, but not used it yet. Come on, David. So I'm just going to pop my stamp right into the corner here. Like so. So stamping it twice. So on this one, I'm going to do a clear embossing, totally clear. So this is going to give our card a touch of elegance here. So Barbara's buzzing. Oh, these are great, great words. Buzzing. I'm buzzing. Feeling jazzed, Maureen. So I'm just using my anti-static bag here, just so I don't get that ugly mess. Then a sticky ink pad and a clear embossing powder. I'll take the lid off ready to go. Let me make sure I've got my gun and everything switched on, good to go. Yep, yeah, all ready. So sticky ink pad, I like to use the wow. Tony, you pronounced my surname correctly. It is Maltese. Gallia. Right, interesting. Don't, don't bank on it being right all the time, though. I'll do my best. <laughs> so this is a sticky ink pad, and I like the wow one. So if you haven't got one of these and you want to do embossing, these are also available on the web. So let's get this detail punched into this cardstock. Give it a good old punch down. Sandra's still a giddy kipper. We'll always be giddy kippers, won't we, Sandra? So I'm going to do it twice, just in case I've missed. Get that good impression on there. Let's just get some cardstock just to catch this embossing powder. One second. Latricia says, jazzed is good, but young people say flash or fly. Interesting. So I'm feeling flashed. Is that right, Latricia? Feeling flashed, I'm feeling fly. Where does Giddy Kipper come from? I have no idea. <laughs> no idea. Does anybody know? It's got to be Yorkshire, hasn't it? So I've got that beautiful detail on there and I'm just going to pop this clear embossing on it. I'm telling you, this is going to look awesome. Gillian Howard, my jazz is getting so buzzed, I'm a giddy kipper. <laughs> oh. Let's heat set this one then, hey? <laughs> so I'm just getting my gun hot. And it's, it's going to look amazing, is this? So this is going to give us that detail in clear on pink. You are looking fly. Remember that one, Tim? You are looking fly. So let's heat set this one. So hopefully you'll be able to see the changing of the powder and this is going to give us like that beautiful touch of elegance where it looks maybe like it's an embossed piece of card actually looks like maybe I've used a nice pink when I actually haven't it's just the clear but really really pretty I'm just going to move my hand down so I don't burn So once the powder changes, just chase that powder. Once a giddy kipper, always a giddy kipper. Totally agree. 
Now let me show you this. Look at that, is that not just beautiful? <gasps> I'm in love, I'm in love. Right, now we're gonna ruin it. I'm only joking. We might do though, we'll see. So the piece of card that is exactly the same size, I'm gonna pop into my Eureka, same place, bottom right. Again, let's just get rid of this clear. And this time, I'm gonna swap out for some gold, okay? So we'll get rid of the clear. And our next color is gonna be gold. Let me just find it. Here we go. So anti-static bag, push the card into the corner. I can't use my magnet because the design is bigger than my cardstock, but I have that corner. So if it moves, I just pop it straight back in the corner. It's absolutely fine. So again, sticky ink pad. <laughs> so this time on white. Nola, I'm pleased you've got a smile on your face, sweetheart. I hope you're okay. Can always come here and get a smile, I promise. So, um, shall we just do it one more time, just in case? Have you all been clicking the shared? I'll pick it. I'll pick a, a. I'll do a giveaway. All you need to do is comment underneath this video when I've gone off air, and then I'll tell you. What can we give away today? Oh, I think. Would anybody like to receive me in the post? <laughs> You'd soon bring me back, I promise. <laughs> Could you imagine opening it? Ta-da! Be like, what? <laughs> Let's get this gold on here. You can see how stunning that is. Wow, that is gorgeous. Now, if you're into your colouring, little to no effort, the shading's there for you. Follow those lines. Never go in the di an opposite direction to where the lines are guiding you. Follow the lines and you'll be absolutely fine. Oh, my giddy aunt, that would make a mint sentiment. It would. Oh, you're all sharing. Thank you so much, guys. Right. Let's heat set this one. So this is the gold. So you can see that. That better? I'll show you it when I've done it anyway, just in case it's I'll just turn it round so I don't burn myself. Does anybody else have that room at home where they literally have to sort of like close the door and run because you can see your life coming to an end if the door opens and it all falls on you? That is honestly my um, sample room at the moment. It's so bad. I'm so embarrassed about it. But it just, just not add a, add a minute and then more samples come, more samples come. Just put it in put it in I'll deal with it because what we normally do is we normally bag them up and give them to charity once um once I get round to doing it so they, I put an envelope in put them in a cellar bag and they go for cancer research I just hadn't had a chance so I've got boxes and boxes um and I've told Tom I'm gonna pay him a pound if he does me a box of them where he puts the envelope in and seals them he said he would so we'll see what happens ask me next week if it's being done <laughs> there we go hi Brian hope you're well Oh, there we go. So you can see, beautiful in gold, 
beautiful in the crystal clear too really really pretty let me show you the technique i've got in mind though so i'll give this stamp away i'll give me beautiful stamp away my gosh let's have some fun now so the idea that i have in mind for this specific card <laughs> charlotte's craft room is the same a cupboard in a craft room's like oh gosh you just don't want to go in it do you because you're like somebody's gonna jump out and get me because it's that bad right so i have my gold and i have my pink let me just get the pattern there we go so you can see there so i have from my stash three circle dies here and the, the ones from the nesting collection got a whole host of nesting dies on there if you don't have any but equally you probably will have some nesting dies and then what i'm going to do on this pink one is i'm just going to sort of create a nice little pattern so i'm going to go i'm going to do some off the page as well um we we'll do something like let's go up there off here maybe and then shall we leave that one as a solid um, let's go like that and then we'll leave this one as a solid and then i'm just going to take some tape just cut a couple of strips of this and the reason i'm going to tape down guys is because i just do not trust my dies not to end up on top of each other which has happened to me several times before because i've just not had the well i can't blame it on not having the time because that's just a poor excuse isn't it i guess but you know just trying to get it done get the job done should we say so let's just tape them down just to be a little bit more careful and then let's bob this through our machine then just gonna, oh dropped it just one second ladies and gents didn't stick that very well did i let's pop it back down so these these actual dies that i've got here they have a lovely stitch around them too so i'm going to get that nice stitch detail so you're really going to be able to create two cards for one here because these beautiful pieces that are going to cut out here are going to have stitch detail on there so i'll be able to um put them on a different card because of that detail so you could do a bit of a spotlight stamp i guess hey move that up right hopefully it'll stay put this time tape's not great but it's better than nothing so let's just pop this through our machine Oh, people's moving and packed eight, eight boxes of craft stuff. My gosh, so the item this one now has now gone limited stock. Okay, limited stock on this one one zero zero three two zero nine pound fifty. If you are in the club, so let's just pop these out. So if you've got maybe square nesting dies or rectangle nesting dies, you can use. And this is what I was saying about these beautiful. Now, if I wanted to make a second card look we could use these on another card look you know use the straight edge on a card maybe i don't know food for thought you know if you had a mat and layer so don't don't get rid of these as that's the second card but what i want is this part and i'll show you why now i'm just going to bring in my gold part and look what's going to happen make sure it's the right set yeah that's it can we see how the pattern matches so the gold into the clear it matches beautifully so let's get this on here now i am going to 3d because i think it'll look really cool 3d so let's get some pads behind so don't be tight with your pads really get those pads on you don't want your design to sort of like flop a little bit so And then maybe cut some in half to get into those sort of little delicate details. 
and he will cut even smaller into these parts here so it, our design doesn't sink. So I'm doing this on like one of the slim, slim line sort of styles, but equally, eight by eight cards, five by sevens. I just, I am conscious sometimes that every time I come to wear, I'm always doing a five by seven. You know how we just have our style, don't we? Sometimes I can't do what I'd love all the time. So I'm just gonna pop this in here and I think I'm gonna need a little one there and there to stop that from sinking. I'll go as, as far as I dare. So today is Technique Tuesday and that's where we sort of try and push our boundaries, maybe, maybe try a new technique. If you're in our group, our How to Craft, not our How to Craft Network, our Eureka fan page, um, we, they always have a technique-based theme in the groups. If you want to get involved with that, you can. Um, so have a look at that as well, but Technique Tuesday, I will always try and do a nice lineup of product for you, if I can, and um, we will always try maybe stepping out of our comfort zone with a technique. So today I'm doing a slimline card, which is not normal for me, but equally we've got two types of embossing going on here. We've got that clear element, which gives you that sort of very embossed classic look, and then the gold underneath, but it's also incorporating that spotlight design as well, where we use a die cut to put a focus on our card as well. So we'll call today's shows Technique Tuesday. So, you know, on Tuesdays, hopefully, I have some fresh inspiration where maybe you're going to think about getting your craft stash back out and having fun with it, hopefully. That's my plan. Samantha Cook. Tony always says her warehouse is full. Is she referring to our houses too? I, I, know, I know what a lot of your houses are like. I know, I've seen some pictures. I cannot be accountable when your husbands tell you off or partners or friends. I will tell you off though if I know you're not using it. <laughs> That's the problem. Right, so we've got our die cut piece here with those sort of details on there. So I'm just gonna remove the backs from here. So remember, to create this technique, both pieces of card need to be exactly the same size to create this sort of illusion technique. However, if you would like to create a matte and layer, then just matte and layer your bottom piece onto maybe some sparkly card or, you know, something like that. You don't really need me to tell you that. I know you're all great crafters anyway. But there are options when it comes to this sort of technique. I like the technique where it's sort of floating like this, but equally, you know, I'm sure you'll all be putting your own twist on it in some way as well. I think, I think we're good. I've got them all off, yep. Yeah. And I might need to match my design back up now. So, take it to the top. Like so. And then, just one second, ladies and gents, I'm just gonna grab my washi tape the infamous washi tape. Now I'm just going to grab all three. I have black, grey and sepia. I know a lot of you at home have got all three colours too. And then we can pick a lovely sentiment, which is going to go with, I need to cut some more grey ones, I'm running low. I think grey goes with everything. Let's have a look. Maybe, maybe sepia today because we've got that gold embossed. Shall we have a look? Oh, let's do this one. This one's a nice one. Let's chat soon. Let's chat soon. And then I'm just going to stick this on like one side. In fact, let's go as far over as we can. And that should really have a little pad underneath, I think, as well. We could put some sparkles on there as well, but I'm not going to because I've got another demo. Are we all okay for time? Well, I um, are we okay to just show 
the products again, Tim, just quickly. And whilst we're just showing you the products again, one more time, ladies and gents, that's just going to give me a chance to get out my second demo. Super, super show today, hey? I am jazzed. I'm totally jazzed. Energised. I'm flying. I'm... Um, all of those words that Latricia said, <laughs> said I forgot. <laughs> I'm flying. Fly. Feeling fly. So that's that one. I'm going to give this away. Don't forget to pop a comment underneath this video after I've gone off air. So that's one giveaway. Move that to the side. So the items on the show, I believe that stamp has now sold out. Please do check later though, because sometimes they do bounce back. I am going to use the other stamp in my next demo. If you like that one, get it quick. There are a handful of those left. And then all of the other items, the cloths are absolutely fine. The paints are fine. The glue, however, gossip is limited stock on those four. Um, sets of pens, sparkly pens, and the tool is limited stock, okay. The item number for the tools, which is a fabulous saving, 100315. You do get that large cutting machine in there as well. So don't forget that incredible value if you are starting out as well. Ready? We're ready? Woo! Right, next card. So I'm going to do a matchy-matchy, but with a different stamp. So I'm going to use this one here. So this one is 100321 and it's the one that's on the end counter. I haven't got my packet here, but it's this one, ladies and gents. And it's got some beautiful sentiments. Let's have a look. Let's celebrate. Find your own happiness. Hey, you. Hey, you. Be stronger than your dreams. Thank you. You are wonderful. Beautiful soul. So it's this one I'm going to use now. It's super big. Let me just show you the size of mine. And it's this one here, look. Mine's very mucky, I'm sorry. It has been used. I do love this stamp. So it's this one here, and it's got a super large floral. It's got those leaves coming out of it. It's got solid leaves. It's got buds in there. And then you get all of those lovely sentiments, which are so, so gorgeous. Right, let's make another card then. I really like this card. I think I just need to put a pad under this bit. I'll do it anyway. I'll show you them both at end. And I'll do giveaway for cards as well. Right, so I have a DL card, a full-length slimline card here. And I'm not, it's not a fancy demo, this one, just to show you how, how, if you are doing, in keeping with theme with your cards, how you can utilise them both. So they're different, but using the same sort of, um, sort of concept. So let's just bring in our um, new weaker here. Now, I'm not using dies in this occasion, just the stamp. And what I'm going to do is I'm just going to pop this into the Eureka here and then I'm going to grab my stamp which really could do with a clean and wouldn't surprise me if I've got if I get gold on my project because it's got some gold in there hey Enid have you seen my dancing crikey so I've just popped it over the corner there and I'm going to do it in black. Galia, as it has just bought this stamp. Well done, sweetheart. It is a beautiful stamp. So I've just caught the corner element of the design there. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to just twist it a little bit, maybe. Let's see where this will go. Don't want as much on this one, so I'm just going to maybe go like that but this time on this corner keeping in theme with our last one okay um let me just clean this off um what i'm gonna do let me just grab my cloth here so i'm grabbing paper i've got my cloth here look. um what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna do this one on this corner clear this is the stamp everyone uh, stamp cleaning cloth so it's smooth one side you can see and it's textured on the other it comes already hydrated, really. It's got sort of a damp feel to it. But run it under your tap or spritz it with your spritz bottle. Get it hydrated and then keep it in here. 
and it will eventually dry out and then all you do is activate it again with water and the good thing about it is because it dries out it doesn't have a bacteria and it never smells it never smells and it can go in your washer at 30 degrees but don't put it in with your other ass white work shirts or all like that i cannot be held accountable for you popping it in to work shirts and things okay and you get two two in that collection today which is an incredible price 9.49 if you are club with your savings and your points less than nine pounds so i'm going to do a clear corner on this one so anti-static And then my sticky ink pad again. If you were doing like wedding invites or table names or something, one could have a number on. One could have a thank you for coming to our celebration. One could have the menu, like this sort of theme, keeping the theme the same, but doing them all in different sort of um, ways, couldn't it? So this is in clear. Hopefully I'm not going to... Uh... Uh... So it is going to give me a bit of colour on there because my stamp is a little bit dirty. So make sure you clean yours off, eh? Hey? I think I might throw some gold on this now. It was going to be clear, but it's going to look odd, isn't it, now? Because it just looks like a little bit of a mess. So I'm going to go gold on this one now, guys. I'm improvising now. It would have been nice and clear, but hey-ho, it is what it is. Let's just grab some card. At least it's going to match. So let me just just get my brush here. Clean it off. So let's heat set this one then. Yes, still saying my cloths look well used compared to yours. That's actually quite a newish one. My ones in my craft bag for TV don't look like that. So this is the gold. So we have gold on one side and black on the other. See that there? How cool is that? Very pretty. But it's not finished yet. So let's just get rid of this awful mucky stamp, which needs a really good clean. And then I'm going to use the big chunky sentiment, which says, find your own happiness. And I'm just going to pop it. straight as I possibly can and this one's going to be in black yeah if you have Enid saying she uses a microfiber cloth that goes in the wash if you have something that works brilliant and then let's push this down Oh, look at that. Does that just not look gorgeous? Now, you could actually go around this with sort of a halo, a pink, just to draw your eye in a little bit, or edge it with a black ink pad. I'm not that brave. I'm just going to give it a bit of a blast, though. Looks lovely already. 
Brenda's saying she must get a new sticking pad, perhaps that's why it's not sticking. Can I just say to you, Brenda, sometimes it's the cardstock you use. Like I have Anna Marie's cardstock and it's amazing. I love it. It takes watercolour really well, but it doesn't like heat embossing. So it could be the cardstock you're using. I would probably say the smoother the better. Um, but sometimes it can be a cardstock. So maybe swap out a different cardstock first, and if it's still not sticking, then maybe get a new sticky ink pad. Try that first, because honestly, embossing, sometimes it all depends what card you're working on as well. Same as watercolouring. You can't get results if you're not doing it on the proper cardstock. So try that first before you invest in another, um, ink uh, another sticky ink pad. Because it could be that. It probably is that, actually. Right, let's just get this on here. So I'm going to raise this one. Again, no, no border as such. I'm totally going for the borderless look, which you would probably get in a, a lovely, classy design. I'm just going to pop some pads all the way around the edge here. So this one now is limited stock. This stamp set is now limited stock, okay? So... 100321. You do take the risk of losing them out of your basket. I won't take them out. I do leave them in for about an hour, but if I see they're sat there um, forever, I do take them out personally myself because we do have people that finish work and I can see them in people's baskets. Then I get an email. So if you want it, check out your basket. Don't hold on to it if you're not if you're not wanting it. 100321. And it's today, it's £9.50 in the club. And it's probably less than £9 if you have points on your account. I have a couple of things to tell you about too in one second. Let me just get this card onto here and show you both of these cards. So I am chuffed with these cards today. Everything went to plan, didn't it? Apart from that little corner of embossing. I would have liked to have done that in clear, but... Oh, Gillian, good, a good question. So the second stamp, I have, I think it's been around the world, my lovely. So we were supposed to get an update last week on it and we didn't and we chased it yesterday and we still haven't had an update on it, but we are on it. We are chasing it. Um, we know there were significant delays, but to what extent we're not exactly sure. But as soon as I know, I'll pop on here and give you a quick update. I'll also pop it on social as well so you can expect it. And what I'll do is I'll send it and then I'll plan the inspiration for the week after I know you've all got it. So you won't miss out, I promise. So let's just get this on here. I think it looks nice without a border, don't you? Very nice. So there we go. Tony Don is asking about sequins and gems. Let's just have a quick look. Have I missed it? Can you just type it again? So two cards, pretty similar. Just turn it that way for you, sorry, Tim. There we go. What do we think? It's very simple, aren't they, in design, but really nice. I like those. Do you like them? Well, I'm going to give these away. All you need to do is comment under the video. Um, when I've gone off air, I'm going to give these two cards. I'm going to give this stamp. And I'll also pop a little surprise in there. I'm not exactly sure because I haven't got my hands on anything. Stunning demos. Thank you, Cathy. You are too kind, sweetheart. You always have been. Right, so that's that. So let me just tell you about a couple of things before we wrap up. You need to save this date, ladies and gents. I can't tell you too much. Save the date, the 25th of February. And you need to save it from 9 a.m. in the morning till 7 o'clock in the evening. You can't go anywhere. You can't book anything. You need to make sure you've got your dinner ready so you can pop it in microwave because I'm with you all day that day. I can't tell you hi. I can't tell you how. I can't tell you who's going to be here but it is a full day of craft. So exciting. Blue gems, yes, Donna, I'm on it. Blue, we haven't got any blues. I appreciate that. Yes, I'm on it. Don't you worry, sweetheart. Gems and sequins and pearls, all in different shades of blues. I'm on it, darling. 25th of February, save the date. I hope you've enjoyed the show. Lots of the items are limited stock. Enjoy the show. I do put them on for you to enjoy and hopefully the prices are affordable for you. Lovely creations today, Latricia. Thank you, Latricia. Thank you so much. Lovely to see you all. Back tomorrow, one o'clock, something else. Exciting. I'll see you all then. See you later, giddy keepers. Don't forget to pop a comment underneath this video. Bye.